I was in um, in a car accident where it kind of threw my neck out of place in a couple spots. But I guess as I got older, those bones, they just started to hurt a lot more. Often very early on, they weren't educated about what it actually means to start using. And then they realize at some point, oh, I'm addicted and I, I can't stop. And I, I do think that pregnancy is a very unique time where people are seeking treatment because they really have an external motivator. Sure. People really want to do what's right for their baby. And their goals may be, oh, I just want to get off opiates so that they're able to really reconnect with other friends, family members, using drugs, unfortunately is a very time-consuming thing. Yeah. So once they break that cycle, they're able to really focus on other things, whether it's taking care of their child or it's reconnecting with their spouse. So I think that's really the goal. And we offer a Friday weekly group. It's called Anew. And this is an opportunity for a social support peer network group to be established. And these women have the opportunity to dialogue with each other, exchanging where they are. And we also offer that supportive counseling um, with respect to where they are. Because of course, when you go into that, you think that you're the one that's, you know, the worst off and to me it don't seem like they treat treat me no different than they would treat a regular patient they treated me like i was a pregnant woman it is truly an example of an interdisciplinary team and i think that the patients feel that and they feel that there is an individualized program that we're trying very best to design for them versus lining them up and providing treatment you know, like I said, I spent a lot of time being homeless, like a year being homeless, and anything could happen. I don't want my kids to ever feel like they don't have anywhere to go, mm -hmm. nobody to turn to. So my main goal is just to, you know, my kids have someone that they can lean on. Being able to have someone share with, I think, was really important to her. And then watching her just grow, I think, was, was just so rewarding. And seeing her now with her baby is just like, such a rewarding part of what I do in addiction work, I think, and why I continue to do it every day.